method 1 using a equals b property if a equals b a squared equals ab subtract b squared from both sides then a squared minus b squared equals ab minus b squared we can write a squared minus b squared equals a plus b into a minus b that is a plus b into a minus b equals b into a minus b this equation is divided with a minus b so we get a plus b equals b we know that a equals b then 2b equals b that is 2 equals 1 so find where is the mistake pause the video and try to solve this problem i hope you find out fifth step is wrong let's check what is mistake in step 5 we are dividing with a minus b we know that a equals b so a minus b is 0 in mathematics division by 0 is not possible method 2 using x squared plus x plus 1 equals 0 let's take x squared plus x plus 1 equals 0 we can divide both side by x then x plus 1 plus 1 by x equals 0 from equation 1 we also get x plus 1 equals minus x squared so we substitute this equation into the equation 2 then we get minus 1 by x equals x squared that is 1 equals x cubed so x equals 1 we substitute x equals 1 in equation 1 then we get 1 squared plus 1 plus 1 equals 0 3 equals 0 subtract minus 1 both sides then 2 equals minus 1 take magnitude then we get modulus of 2 equals modulus of minus 1 or 2 equals 1 where is the mistake pause the video and try to solve this problem i hope you find third step is wrong that is when you substitute 1 plus x equals minus x squared you got minus x squared equals 1 by x this equation has solution x equals 1 but x equals 1 is not a solution of x squared plus x plus 1 equals 0.